Ward with a biting challenge. Bryson blocked by Wilson. Russell to try to keep the derby pressure on. Mascarell. All the talk was... Christie. Mansbury. Pushing it well for Bryson. There is side down. Have to make sure you get it. And the end is nowhere near it. Again, Bryson breaking forward. Nowhere near it. Gary Gardner deserves to be booked for that. In Nottingham Forest, apart from the corner. Mascarell attacked it. from Forest after going a goal down and thought they'd have a real struggle in the second half but that's often them very hard to make their way back into the game Mascarell that's pretty low down heads clear Christie Martin is up there Buxton said to keep it alive before Keogh clears Wilson the Son Belongas underneath this one Keogh under it again for Derby Still alive, Keogh goes to ground, the flag goes up on this near side. So even if uh, had found a way beyond Lee Grant, it wouldn't have counted. Mascarell misses out, Osborne has open ground ahead of him. He's got a sombre longer as well if he can find him. Osborne doesn't need him! Ben Osborne! Nottingham Grant is going to be happy at all, he's conceded here, but Ben Osborne for a split second made the wrong choice, he had an overlapping run, should he have played the ball, he decided to shoot it deep into added on time, he made exactly the right choice, he has been outstanding in the second half, and what a turnaround. But they give the ball away so cheaply here, Derby, and then suddenly Forrester breaking, I talked about belief, about it going on and winning a game, he's done well to get back into, it's a thunderous strike for Ben Osmond, but I still think Lee Graham will be unhappy that he's not saved this. Take nothing away from the youngster. That is a quite brilliant effort. He'd never scored a senior. He's got one that'll be spoken about on the banks of the. And he would have to say, from what's happened in the second half here, that Forest do deserve to be ahead. They've been the more forceful side. He has been out. Well sent on for the remaining minutes. Mascarell, oh, Buxton's got his head to it. LaSalle's out as far as Russell, who fires wide. Well, it's not easy for Johnny Russell, he's under pressure. That's the choice here, refining this back of, into the six-yard box or taking the shot on. He goes for glory, there's lots of red shirts between him and an amazing result for Forrest. Well, let's hear how it feels and get some reaction from some Nottingham Forest players in the company of Jonathan Oakes. Ben and Britt, well done, Ben, ever senior goal, what a time for it, just sum that up for us. Oh, unbelievable, like, I don't feel like I've done it. I was getting met all my mates, the Derby fans, and I was getting messages from them last night, like, don't score the winner, and <laughs> it's gone and happened, my first goal, it's unbelievable feeling. What changed in that second half? I think we were just at more, I think we got a few set pieces early in the second half, and we just kept the pressure on from there, really, I think we won the majority of the 50-50s uh, in the second half. And we just stayed in the game, and that's what we have been able to do recently, stay in the game, and we got the win at the end, so, was it? Britt, your 14th goal for Forrest, is that the most important so far? You know, look, everyone's going to say, oh, we won here, this is probably kicked off our season, but, you know what, we're just everyone's going to say, oh, we won here, most important so far, was it? Britt, your 14th goal for Forrest, is that the most important so far? You know, look, everyone's going to say, oh, we won here, this is probably kicked off our season, but, you know what, we just have to take a get, go game by game and I think that's one of the most important goals I've scored in my career and, you know, just, we're just going to go on a high now. We're just going to go on to the next game and take every game as it comes, hopefully to win all the games. Yeah, what can you do now this season? Can this be a springboard for you? We're not going to get ahead of ourselves like right now, but we're going to, as I said, we're going to take it game by game. Stuart Pearce has been under pressure. How much was that for the manager today? Yeah, massively. We gave a uh, team talk at the hotel, which was quite emotional, got everyone fired up and... 
Yeah, we just wanted to put a good performance in. The fans as well, they've been backed us all the way, so massive. Well done, thank you for joining us. Brave for you to do that, please. Ben Osborne is the Skybet man of the match. Yeah, you go! Thank you, sir. Bit of steam on the camera, but who can blame him? Because it has been a long, long way for him to get back to winning ways. It's only a third win in 21, but what a mature performance from that man there, Ben Osborne. The man born in Nottingham came through the Forest Academy 20 years of age in his first ever senior goal for Forest. And what a stage to do it on. And what relief you would think for Stuart Pearce, who came into this game with all kinds of questions about his future. But one thing the fans have never done, even in games recently against the likes of Sheffield Wednesday and Birmingham, the fans have never stopped chanting his name. They continue that today before the winner. And congratulations, Melanie.